Hello. Um, this is not the Roskilde video. That's because my friend Mickey, who has the camera, went to Turkey for two weeks. So, uh, sorry about that. Instead, I am going to be talking about the placebo effect. And uh, if you don't know what that is, it's basically uh, the effect on how you think, on how you feel. Uh, it can have a huge impact on many different illnesses, and this has been well researched as well. Um, not just mental illness, it's like physical stuff as well, and even things like cancer have been shown to have much better chance of getting cured if you think the right way about it. Um, what I wanted to mention is that I think it can also work the other way around. Um, nowadays, when you go into psychiatry a little bit, you're going to find words for every possible kind of thing that you can feel bad about and ways to feel bad about them. And in a way, um, I'm not sure how healthy that is because when you sit there reading it going, oh yeah, that's me and oh, that, that fits perfectly, I could have w whatever. Uh, I think thinking like that uh, isn't just dangerous because you might end up thinking you have it, but because you might end up having it because you think you have it. Um, so really don't uh, identify uh, your, yourself by a mental illness. You, it, it, if it's part of your life, you need to make it, you know, not in control of your life. And if you spend all day reading about it, researching it, and you know what. <laughs> Uh, watching my videos constantly because of it, um, then maybe that's not the best way to go about it for you. Uh, maybe you need to do something else. But of course, I'm not saying that if you have, like, if you already have a mental illness for one reason or the other. I'm not saying don't seek treatment or don't tell anyone about it or anything like that. I'm just saying don't build your life around it if you can help it because that can really make it a lot worse I've at least in my experience um, not my personal experience because I haven't actually had a proper relapse before but but I think maybe the way that I thought about it uh, made it worse for me as well so uh, and the major change that has happened in my life since then is that I've changed the way I'm thinking I still have pretty much all the symptoms but I've just found ways to deal with them so that I don't have to be impaired by it. And I think that's that's very important to note. So um yeah, that's me on the placebo effect and um I'll see you guys at least in two weeks with that Roskilde video. Uh apart from that, maybe I'll upload one next week. We'll see. Bye.